it felt like a giant bee sting burned like a um, intense amount of pressure. And I just kind of laid my head down on my arm to the side and I just saw the blood filling the counter. The bullet came crashing through the window of the home near Denver, Lancaster County in late February and hit Jamie Horning in the neck. Absolute chaos. Complete panic. I like you can't the term all hell broke loose doesn't even seem to like define the moment. Jamie's mom sprung into action and put pressure on the wound to stop the bleeding. It's like I was so scared. When I saw the blood, I thought for sure I was like, well, this is a jugular vein issue and people don't survive that. This is it. But Jamie never lost consciousness and was rushed to the hospital. Doctors were amazed she survived. For Jamie, it's a life-changing experience. It's all by the grace of God. I have no idea. Obviously, he's not finished with me yet. I'm just trying to figure out what, what his plans are for me. And seven people have been charged with reckless endangerment in Jamie's shooting. Police say that they were shooting at a tree stump from a second floor deck about 1,600 feet from the home. And I'm going to have much more on Jamie's incredible story coming up tonight at 6, including that bullet mm -hmm. is still in Jamie's neck. We had the x-ray. We'll show it to you tonight. It's amazing. And she survived all of this. Her mom saved her life. I yeah, mean, she no did. There's no doubt about that. And, and the whole thing, there's several different reasons that, that she shouldn't have survived, but she did. But she's sitting so. there in the comfort and safety of her parents' home, and something like that happens, it's you know? It's a really nice afternoon with family, and that happened. Wow. So, yeah. Wow. Look more tonight at 6. Yeah, definitely.